Hey, Jake, you know what it's time for? I sure do. Jake, Jake and Rose's, Rose's first impressions. impressions. Cast off pattern on the far wall suggests upward knife slices, Jake. Wounds on the Vic's back means he didn't see the killer coming. Rosa? Laptop, wallet, keys, all in plain sight. No sign of forced entry, doesn't connote a robbery, Jake. But it does connote that our killer was waiting for Adams in the apartment. Did I just use the word connote correctly? You did. Great, will you text that to Amy? I don't want to say what using a vocabulary gets me. Okay. Sexual intercourse. Oh, gross. What? We're adults. I'm his mother, let me in. <sighs> Rock, paper, scissors for us to talk to the Vic's mom. Deal. It's a game of chance. How do you always win? You always pick paper. That is not true. Here, go again. One more time. All right, one more time. One more time. One more time. One more time. All right, one more time. One more time. God, this reverse psychology is a bust! Ma'am, I'm Detective Peralta. This is Detective Diaz. I'm so sorry for your loss. Please tell me whatever you can. Nobody will tell me anything. I really wish that I could, but we're just starting our investigation. Now, is there anyone you can think of that would want to hurt your son? No. Everybody loved Andrew. I don't know why this happened. Please, you have to find who did this. We're doing everything we can. Promise me you'll find who did this. Ma'am, we can't promise. Promise me. Andrew is my whole world. I'm a single mom. I promise you. Wow, you really are an idiot. Um, excuse me? Did you really just promise a victim's family member we would solve a crime? Oh, come on. I was just consoling her. No, it was a full-on promise, and it wasn't just her. Yes, Betty, I promise I will find your friend's son's killer. Yes, you can put your husband on. I'll promise him, too. Okay, well, what's his number at work, then? Do you have a pen? 